Now, if you drive up and down the M40, you'll have seen this place during your journey. Well, today I get to go inside as there's an exciting collaboration that's just started. Keith, here at ProDrive, first question for you is which one of these is yours? Uh, the little one at the back. Can you fit in that? <laughs> yeah, not now. <laughs> now, let's, um, on, on a serious note, this is a, a tremendous step forward for Colchester Machine Tool Solutions, isn't it? What is the relationship? What's happening here at ProDrive in Banbury? Oh, we've got a great relationship with them. Uh, started about 12 months ago. We've now got four machines in here, all CNC machines. There's a further three coming within the next few weeks as well. It's a two-way relationship where we're allowed to uh, show people uh, or showcase our machines, but in this environment, which is fantastic for, for both us and ProDrive. And, and the beauty of it is they're actually using the machines here as well, aren't they, for, for manufacturing components, which is testament to the quality of, of your products. Yes, they have a lot of first-class customers. I mean, the parts that they're producing on the machines at the moment are actually for Aston Martin Racing. So. Now, you've been instrumental in this relationship and I, I assume it's benefiting both parties. Can you explain to our audience how, how this is benefiting both Definitely. parties? Definitely. I mean, due to the great location, just off the M40, we're in the heart of the motorsport valley, as they call it. So from the area that I cover, this is brilliant to bring people up to, to see a working showroom of our machine tools. Because, it's being sensible, people down in Southampton are not going to want to go all the way up to say Ellen to see our machine so this this is a great location from that point of view and it also a fantastic company like ProDrive it instills confidence that they're investing in our machine tools and you can see them working. Now Ben you know a lot of engineers out there would still associate the Colchester the iconic Colchester name with manual machine tools but it's not the case here at, at ProDrive it's, it's full of, of CNC machine tools mills and lathes. Correct so we've already got on the floor four CNC's two of which are VMC milling machines and then we've got a subspindle uh, live tool in machine and also just a standard c-axis um, lathe as well so no this is the what we need to get out there is that we are more than a conventional machine tool supplier we supply a range of machine tools to all sorts of applications ben now this is um, a little bit different to what you'd class as a traditional showroom isn't it because there's actually sort of work in progress going on in here not just demos cutting light materials they're doing proper work at ProDrive. I mean that's the whole idea it's great to go to a showroom and see the machines uh, in a stagnant format if you like but to actually see them working and making high-end precision parts I think is far more beneficial and again it gives the potential customer a real uh, secure feeling that these machine tools are proper. And you can also, I suppose, talk to the operators, can't you? And I mean, you're, you're almost talking to your customer as well as you maybe, so you can learn the technicalities of the machine, but actually get a warm feeling for how reliable, accurate, and you know, steadfast they are in making good parts. Exactly. Engineers talk engineers' language. They're on the same level. They can ask questions that we might not necessarily think of, and, and the feedback that they can get back from them would be, would be priceless. Yeah, so I did an apprenticeship here at ProDrive. I started off as an assistant and then they put me through an apprenticeship, mostly doing manual machining. And, and until we, these arrived, when we got the Colchester machines, and then I started learning more about the CNC side of things. I find them really easy to pick up. And what will you cut? What materials will you make? Because it's quite a diverse business, isn't it? Some of, the, yeah. some of the projects that you guys are involved in here at ProDrive. Yeah, a lot of what we do is aluminium, but um, with the, some of the newer projects coming through, there's a lot of titanium work. Um, we do do some, uh, some mild steels as well, but it's mostly titanium or aluminium. Maybe. And what about your programming side as well then? Uh, you've got the FANUC system here, do you use the manual guide? Yeah, it's really helpful actually. Um, obviously, most FANUC controllers, there's not really any conversational side of it at all, but on there when you use the guide, it really does make it a lot simple. And when you're chasing tolerances, what are you trying to make parts to on some occasions, just to illustrate how uh, how precise these machines can be? The easiest tolerance that we have is uh, 0.25, but generally speaking, a lot with the newer projects, a lot of it's um, 01, 015. But not. Okay, so pretty tight tolerances, yeah. machines hitting them every uh, every step of the way. Ever break down? No, not it break yet. Yeah, it's been really reliable so far. Yeah. Um, now, Colchester Machine Tool Solutions, you, you ventured into multi-axis automation almost really in, in recent years, haven't you? This is, this is a big demand from your customers at the moment and, and the country in general. Yeah, I mean, people know us for our conventional machines. They don't realise what we can actually do and what we can achieve. 
we are a solutions-based customer uh, company now, um, and therefore people are coming onto us for multi-axis machines, automation. We can integrate robots. We can do laser marking. Uh, you know, in a cell format. So a, a one-stop shop, really. And, it, and it's a, a brilliant place to come to obviously see your equipment. But I'm assuming when you when you get to you have to walk through what we are seeing yeah. here in order to get to um, your machines. Yeah. Now, of course, you've got your uh, new showroom in Elland as well, but. Yep. People that don't necessarily want to travel all the way out north can come here and witness the same technology. Yeah, Banbury is virtually in the centre of the country, so people from down south, the southwestern parts of the country, can get here really easy. You know, it's just on the doorstep of the M40. Um, it's a lovely facility to come to as well.